FL Studio Today we're going to look at de-essing options in FL Studio. Here's a vocal with prominent S sounds. We will not be held responsible for any hearing impairments or damage caused to you from excessive exposure to this sound. I'm going to show you three methods for de-essing in FL Studio using Fruity Multiband Compressor, which is free, Maximus, which is not free but it's good, and Edison, which is free. First up, the Multiband Compressor. What we want to do is selectively compress, that's peg the maximum amplitude of the high S frequencies when they happen. We want to let through some S sounds, but to limit how loud they get. Start by muting the low and mid-band frequencies and set the compression ratio of the high band to minimum. Play your sample and adjust the frequency of the cutoff so you can hear mainly the sibilant S sound. Bypass the lower two bands to allow their frequencies through unaltered and adjust the threshold and compression ratios of the high frequency band to taste. We will not be held responsible for any hearing impairments or damage caused to you. This bar shows the compression is active. Sound. We will not be held responsible for any hearing impairments or damage. Let's check the before and after. We will not be held responsible. We will not be held responsible. OK, next up is Maximus. It's the same principle, but things are a little easier. Select the de-essing preset. This uses the mid-band, deactivating the others. Turn on the monitoring and look for your sibilance. We will not be held responsible for any hearing Set the upper and lower limits. or damage caused to you from excessive exposure to this sound. We will not be held responsible. Exposure then adjust your compression sound. curve by ear. That sets the level of de-essing. For any hearing impairments or damage caused to you from excessive exposure to this sound. Finally, the manual method with Edison. We are in my favourite mode, spectral view. It's great for visualising sounds when you're cleaning them up. You can clearly see the sibilant S sounds here. Select one, open your EQ tool and EQ it out. Adjust the amount control to taste. Now you can work through your sample, reducing the sibilance. Let's hear that. We will not be held responsible for any hearing impairments or damage caused to you from excessive exposure to this sound. Excellent. So there are three ways, two free, that you can DS vocals in FL Studio. Until next time, enjoy your DSing.